Okay. Friendship journals. You want to deepen your relationships with people around you, and you want to go through some questions. Maybe you can take it to a coffee shop. Three different sections and photography from yours truly. Or and if you want to get it to a friend as a gift, these might be a little fun. These are proofs, so they the original ones or the actual ones won't have this big old not for resale. But they're on Amazon and link is in the description below. So next loop that we're doing is the ENFP. <laughs> I have some ENFP friends and they are rather dear to me. Um, and then, so once I was discovering about the loop, it was fun realizing like, oh, so that's what was going on. So with the ENFP, we're gonna go into their function stack. Their function stack is extroverted intuition, introverted feeling, extroverted thinking, and then introverted sensing. And so when they are working and their finest, they're going to be using their first functions, extroverted in intuition and introverted feeling. Um, and so they're gonna be really excited about it, like possibilities and like adventure. Um, but then their second function draws right into um, like their personal morals and people that are really important to them. ENFPs, if you are a part of this, I would love to hear your insights. I hope that this is a first kind of a uh, platform and then we can have a conversation about it and people can learn from you. Um, but this is from what I have studied and I'm drawing from um, the people that I know. So um, the loop is not a bad thing initially. Um, it's just when we're under a lot of press and stress, pr press and stressors, <laughs> press, press, pre stress and pressure. We start to shift into this loop where we're no longer using the two functions that are opposite of each other. We're now using two functions that are both either introverted or extroverted, depending on if you're an introvert or extrovert. So with the ENFP, both functions that are in the loop are going to be extroverted. So you're going from extroverted intuition and now it's being fed in and filtered through extroverted thinking. And so initially that's not a bad thing, but when you get stuck there, you start obsessing over um, different things and each type has a different obsession, which I think is very curious and interesting to learn. When the ENFP starts to exit out of their normal uh, functioning. They're gonna start hyper analyzing facts. Um, the different experiences that they have are no longer being filtered through like their internal moral code, but they're being rather aggressive. They're obsessed over all the new outcomes of different situations, but then they start analyzing those new outcomes and situations, which then can breed more outcomes and situations for them to hyper analyze and they can get stuck in this terrible <laughs> um, cycling uh, that is not producing anything clarifying for them, which I guess would be why um, introverted feeling, because that's one of the things that they would really need to do is to retreat and to go visit people that are really important to them. And not just that, but they need to revisit like what's really important to them, what's their moral code, what are their beliefs, and just being able to retreat. Um, and get and gain that clarity. But we also have to recognize that that is just something that should be going alongside with your healing process. Whatever is pushing you into that loop um, is it a constant pressure to perform a certain way or to please a certain situation, or are you finding yourself stuck at a dead end or you know, there's marriage on in the future, but then you're realizing what you've been doing isn't really going to support like maybe a, a married situation um, and you're starting to panic about that or in your relationship with somebody, they seem to be kind of aloof about the relationship for some reason. You can't find grounds as to why and so you're starting to get really aggressive about it or there's people in your com uh, in your work that you're really upset and frustrated about because of whatever they do and so you're feeling like maybe you should leave or go to a different job or whatever and it's just kind of all these different things. And so it's like being able to retreat, inquire people that you really admire, and also just kind of find clarity with your values to be able to kind of know what you need to do when you go back into those situations, because you may have to make hard choices um, and confront certain situations that you wouldn't do, you wouldn't know to do when you're just analyzing everything. Um, you need the clarity of your introverted feeling. So, ENFPs, please give more detail below. Um, and also don't forget these books. Descriptions are in the section below. And um, 
see another life or you or never know that was bad see you in another video or another life you never know Bye.